Hey guys, welcome back or welcome to my channel. So today's video is going to be our cash envelope and sinking fund stuffing for May's paycheck number two. This is our last paycheck in May as I do get paid bi-weekly. Um, but yeah, let's just go ahead and jump into this here. Um, I know last time I filmed my video really, really late. I think it hasn't even been a week or maybe a week today since I'm filming this um, that I am putting up another video, but that's okay because we need to get back on track before I go into labor. And when I go into labor, these videos obviously aren't going to be as frequent uh, because I obviously will be a new mom and be taking care of my baby. Um, but also I won't be working as, or I'll be taking some time off. So my paychecks will be looking a little bit different. I don't know exactly how they're going to be looking um, the first couple of weeks. So if I don't have any cash stuffing videos, that is why. I just haven't figured out exactly, you know, what my paycheck is going to look like. I might not even have enough money to put aside for sinking funds. Most of it probably just be going to bills. So that's probably one other reason as well. But when we get there, we'll see what comes about. So to start off with our groceries, it is going to get $30. We did, um, what was I going to say? We did um, spend or go grocery shopping recently. So that is why this one is empty. Um, but it was good because we actually went really ham on groceries this past week actually no it was a couple days ago like two or three days ago so good thing i had that set aside because it was quite a lot of food um gas is also going to get thirty dollars we with me being i'm 38 weeks pregnant now um so i do start going to my doctor's appointment by or every week so that is uh, taking up some gas. <laughs> usually I don't, you know, usually I have some money left over in my gas envelope, but we've been going everywhere, trying to get everything done for the baby's room. So gas is also climbing. So that's another reason as well. Um, eating out is gonna get, oh, I have a dollar. Okay, I'm gonna actually set this to the side. Um, I'll go ahead and stuff an envelope with that. But eating out in tips, I have money left in tips as well. Two dollars, I'll go ahead and put this off to the side to be stuffed later. Um, eating out in tips is gonna get $40. So let me actually just, I know I have no money in allowance. I don't know how much money I have left in household, but we're gonna do Thirty dollars in eating or eating out, and then ten dollars in tips. So we'll do thirty dollars for eating out. Oops. And then for ten dollars, we're just going to do five, six, seven, eight, nine, and ten. So we have five, six, seven, eight, nine, ten for tips. Household is gonna get ten dollars, and I think, yeah, I knew we had some money. 20, 40, 50, 60. I'm just gonna add the 10 here. So now we have 20, 40, 50, 60, 70. We still need to buy dog food, so this is most likely going to be empty. Um, if not, I know we need to buy some like toilet paper, paper towels, stuff like that. So that's good to have. Allowance, oh, I do have some money. $3 as well. I'm just gonna put this off to the side since that's extra. And then allowance is gonna get $30. Perfect, so cash envelopes are done. Moving on to our bills section, 
phone. This is fully funded, but I'm going to fund the second part of, or not, or, so the way I do my phone and my car payment, basically all my bills, but really phone and car, I like to take out in cash. That way I don't just randomly spend it. Um, you know, like by swiping my card, it's already set money aside. And I don't have to worry about it. So this payment is for May. This is already done. Um, but I like to start the next payment. So for June, I'll set $21 aside. And then when I get paid again in June, I'll set another $21 aside and that will be fully funded for June. So hopefully that makes sense. But there's another $21 there. Need to fix this envelope. And then same with car as well. This one is already funded for the month of May. So we're just gonna start our first payment for June. And that's gonna be 207. Six, seven. Which we can actually just go ahead and deposit this back into the bank. That way this envelope isn't so chunky. That's a chunky boy right there. All right. And then moving on to our sinking funds, we're going to start with our pink binder. As always. So Baby Ramirez is going to get $45. I need to actually so 20, 40, 45. I need to exchange these for, exchange some 20s for some smaller bills. So maybe that I'll do that in another video. In Baby Ramirez, we have 100. 200, 20, 40, 60, 80, 300, 20, 40, 60, 80, 90, 95, 400, 450, 455, 456. So 456. I took off my nails because I don't know if you can tell, but my pinky broke. Like this still has acrylic on it and we were trying to move some stuff around in his room and I broke it. So it like literally took off my almost my whole nail. So I decided, you know what, just take them off and then I'm going to get gel done because once the baby comes, I don't want to be, you know, having long nails dealing with that. So just going to be easier just to get gel. So do excuse my nails from the time being. Wedding is going to get 35 35, oops, 20, 10, and 5. All right, so wedding we have 100, 200, 20, 40, 60, 20, 40, 60, 80, 300, 20, 40, 60, 80, 400, 20, 40, 60, 80, 500, 20, 40, 60, 80, 600, 650, 60, 70, 80, 85, 90, 690 in wedding. Honestly, super proud of myself for saving up so this much money so far for our wedding because we kind of don't really know what we're going to be doing yet. We don't know if we're going to be in the United States or if we're going to be, you know, just do a small destination wedding. So having at least this much money set aside, perfect. Um, that way, you know, we're not super stressing come the time that we actually need to start planning. Car tags is going to get $5 per usual. So in car tags, we have 10, 20, 25, 30, 35. Sorry if my table is shaking. My dog just, hi bug, is nosy right now. <laughs> um, medical is gonna be getting 15. Bless you. So we have 10, 
105. So medical, we have 50, 70, 90, 110, 130, 150, 170, 190, 210, 230, 240, 250, 260, 265, 266, 267. 267 in medical. Not too shabby. Debt Snowball will be getting $20. So in Debt Snowball, we have 20, 40, 60, 80, 90, 100, 10, 20, 25, 30. So 130 in Debt Snowball. Savings is also going to get $20. So we have 20, 40, 60, 80, 90, 100, 10, 20, 30, 35, 40. 140. Emergency, we'll be getting 15. 10 and 5. So in emergency, there's 20, 40, 50, 60, 70, 80, 90, 100, 5, 10, 15. 115. I'm trying to focus out of these three envelopes. I'm trying to really focus on debt snowball. Um, I am almost done paying off my Mac computer, so I'm really just trying to beef up this envelope out of the three, um, and that way I can make an extra payment, and it would be, I think. With this extra payment, I think it's pretty much done, plus that, you know, my monthly payment. So I'm just gonna try to beef it up a little bit more. That way it's completely paid off and we are done with another debt, which is always good to get that knocked down. So that is it for our pink binder. Moving on to our purple one here. Beauty is gonna get $20. I haven't gotten my toes done yet or anything, so this will most likely go towards that. So we have 20, 40, 50, 55. Now that I need my nails done because I took them off, this should be more than enough for both of those. Uh, Kindness Designs isn't going to get anything this paycheck. Travel will be getting its usual $10. In travel, we have 10, 20, 30, 40, 50, 60, 70, 80, 90, 95. Almost at 100 for travel, which $10 for this is really a good amount for us right now because we really don't have any plans to go anywhere. You know, pandemic, baby, everything. <laughs> so it's good to at least have some money for when we do. Sublimation won't be getting stuffed this time either. Christmas will be getting 15. So we have five and 10. So in Christmas we have 20, 40, 60, 70, 80, 90, 100, 10, 20, 30, 35, 40. So 140 in Christmas. House will be getting five dollars. So we have 20, 30, 40, 50, 55, 60, 65, 70. And house is money set aside for our down payment or really anything that we need for our when we purchase a house. This isn't a priority right now because there isn't really a rush for us to buy a house with the housing market it's super crazy in arizona i'm sure is it's super crazy everywhere else in the in the states at least um so when the time comes at least we'll have some money set aside for when we want to officially start purchasing a house car maintenance is going to get ten dollars in car maintenance we have 10 20 30 30 oh i'm sorry 
10, 20, 30, 40, 50, 55, 60. Which this envelope I'm trying to beef up as well because I will need to be getting some tires, not soon, but relatively in the near future. Sorry, the trash man is picking up our trash right now. So I do apologize if you can hear that. But our pups envelope is gonna get 15, which should be the rest of these fives. Five, 10, 15, yep. So we have 20, 30, 40, 45, 50, 55. Perfect. I totally forgot that we had some extra money sitting on the side over here. So we have one, two, three, four, five, six dollars. Usually I, it depends on if I will stuff a envelope from my $200 or 200 count envelope challenge. Um, it really depends if how much money I have left over from my cash envelopes and if I want to roll that over still or put it aside, just depending on what my budget is looking like at that time. So I'm actually gonna roll these $6 over into an envelope. I do believe I have, I had an envelope stuffed with $6 or with $10. Yeah, so here I have an extra 10. So what I think I'm going to do is stuff our $16 envelope. That way this one is stuffed as well. Let me go ahead and cross off 16. Here we go. And then this envelope will be filled. So let's make sure we have 10, 11, 12, 13, 14, 15, 16. Perfect. Awesome. All right. So that is officially the end of this video. Um, if you guys have any questions, definitely leave them down below. I do try to answer them. Um, if not, then I will try to answer your questions in a video. Um, but that is the end of today's video, guys. I will see you guys next time. Bye.